In the Moravian daily text, the watcher for today says, Happy are those who keep his decrees, who seek him with their whole heart. Psalm 119 verse 2 the, uh, the accompanying doctrinal text is taken from Matthew 5 verse 19. It reads as follows. Therefore, whoever bends, breaks one of the least of these commandments and teaches others to do the same will be called least in the kingdom of heaven. But whoever does them and teaches them will be called great in the kingdom of heaven. As we reflect on the spiritual renewal of our Moravian ancestors, let us hear what God will say to us through today's watchword. Happy are those who keep his decrees, who seek him with their whole heart. Seek him with your whole heart, not half, quarter, or if, your whole heart. Follow the Lord wholeheartedly, and he will bless you. He will grant you wisdom and guidance. He will be the shepherd that leads you to the path of righteousness. Because he is the Lord, his power knows no bounds, and his reach is everlasting. John 14 verse 21 states, Those who accept my commandments and obey them are the ones who love me. My Father will love those who love me. I too will love them and reveal myself to them. God is King. His word is law. Judges 8 verse 23 states, The Gideon told them, I will not rule over you, nor will my son rule over you. The Lord will rule over you. Therefore, accept and obey his commandments fearlessly, courageously, because he said he will never leave you nor forsake you. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. How amazing is that? The Lord with his everlasting power himself says he will be with you. He will be beside you. Why fear? Seek him. Seek him with your whole heart. These things are reiterated when we learn of the events of the spiritual baptism of the Moravian Church. When we give our whole hearts to the Lord, there is no room for anything but love and happiness. We become one. None of our earthly prejudices exist, and just as the events on August 13, 1727 were documented, illustrating love, we in this generation must do the same and find peace. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, you are King, ruler of all. I thank you for being by my side. Help us to give our whole hearts to you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.